Hey guys, I got a new video for you today, and we're going to be taking a look at an item that I feel everybody should own at least one of, and that is a great pair of binoculars. This one here is from a company called Knox Provisions, and it is their 8x25 standard issue waterproof binoculars. They were gracious enough to send it over to me so I can check it out and do an unboxing on it. So I will be showing you exactly what all comprises the standard issue binoculars, what's inside of the box, and then my opinion on it. This particular one is in the cobalt blue color, but it is available in quite a few different colors, so you can go ahead and pick the one that you like. If you're interested, go ahead and take a look at the description box below for a link to the Knox Provision website where you can see some information on this one, and maybe go ahead and pick up one for yourself. Now, on to the unboxing. So this particular model is available in two different options. You either have the 8x25 option, which is the one that I have here, or the 10x25 option. And that just depends on what you're gonna be needing from your binoculars themselves. The really cool thing about it is it's also available in a ton of different colors. I believe this 8x25 option is available in like seven or eight different colors. Um, this one right here, as you guys can see from the label, is the cobalt blue color. Um, I actually chose that color because it's nice and vibrant, it's easy to see, easy to find, especially at night if you drop them or something like that. Don't know why you would be using a pair of binoculars at night, but again, maybe you're carrying it around and it, and it falls out of your pack or something like that. So this is the box that it comes in. Um, it does give you some information in the back. So eight time optical zoom, waterproof and fog proof, good eye glass optics and natural grip. So let's go ahead and open it up and we'll take a look at everything that comes with it. All right. So um, I really like when companies take advantage of the boxes and they put a lot of information on there. You know, you can pull out a manual and read some of the information, but if you're opening up the box and it's already there, um, you know, why not? So, uh, you know, it gives you a couple of uh, uses of it. So it says wayfinding, creature spotting, cosmic gazing, and bike packing. Again, cosmic gazing maybe at night to use it for that. So there you go. That's why you would be using your binoculars at night. Um, it also says line scouting, bird watching, overlanding, and don't be a creeper. Uh, I love that. Obviously, you know, use it for what's intended. I'm um, not sure if you can make it out, but in the top right here, it says get ready to feast your eyes. And then it says some quick tips to get you started. Um, you know, it does say to twist out the eye cups, um, twist the eye cups counterclockwise to extend for optimal performance and dial in for each eye. So using only your left eye, turn the central focus wheel A to focus on an object at least 25 feet away. So again, you know, if, if you've used binoculars in the past, you know how those work. And you know, it's cool that they do give you a little bit of information. So inside here you have the binoculars themselves. Let's see if I can get them out. All right, there we go. And then in the bottom there it says, watch what you see. And it's got like a little, what is it, a raccoon um, looking around. So that's interesting. So really, really cool. Um, some more information on the outside of the box here. A fully recyclable box is printed with soy-based inks and made with 90% post-consumer recycled cardboard. All right, great. I'm feeling great so far. So here we go. Um, here is the binoculars themselves. Again, this one is in the cobalt blue color. And then it says, grab the knocks and pull up. And then it says, strap and pouch inside. So grab the knocks and pull up. Okay, there we go. Got them out of there. Um, and then last but not least is another feature that I was really, really um, interested that they offer because I've actually used or tr attempted to do this in the past with a pa another pair of binoculars is you can actually take a picture. They sell an attachment that attaches to the, um, the knocks themselves and it allows you to use your phone to look through the binoculars and take a, a magnified picture. So that's really cool. Um, so it does give you a little bit of a, a, a tutorial here on how to do that. So that's cool that they include it there. So let's go ahead and take a look at the accessories in here. I'm gonna put this back in the box there. So you have a carrying pouch here. Um, it is uh, branded, again, watch what you see, Knox. Um, so that's really cool, I like that. I don't think I've ever had a pair of binoculars that came with a pouch like this. 
Uh, usually the ones that I have come with some sort of case or something like that. But again, because this is such a smaller size binocular, I like the fact that they included the case so I can just put it in there and not have to worry about them. You also get a cleaning cloth here, very important to make sure that you maintain those uh, lenses nice and clean. And then you have a uh, neck strap here also, really, really cool. So I like when companies kind of include in the packaging everything that you're gonna need to get yourself started. So let's go ahead and take a look at the binoculars. Again, this is the standard issue waterproof, waterproof binoculars from Knox. They do have um, you know, other choices in case you're looking for, um, for different styles or different sizes and things like that. So obviously check out the link below to their site in case you are interested in those. Um, so, you know, again, as I mentioned in the box, you can, you know, twist the eye cups in and out to make sure that you get the optimal uh, fit and that they look really nice. Uh, a fit and finish, they feel really, really nice. I love the, the grip texture that it has on here. You know, you're definitely not going to be dropping these, especially if you're going to be using them in situations where um, your hands might get wet um, or cold. You know, you can get a good grip on the binoculars here and not have to worry about it. You have the center ring right here. Uh, spins very, very smoothly. I'm not feeling any type of resistance or anything like that, which is great. Same thing with the eye cups here when you go to focus them. And then, um, you know, just when they close in and out, they feel really really comfortable now you do have the sections on the outside here where the strap is going to attach to uh, but all in all it looks like a very simple easy to use pair of binoculars and again this is exactly what i was looking for you know i don't normally use binoculars in my day-to-day -day life but it's always good to have them because that situation might come up where you are going to need them so having a good pair of binoculars is always a good option and i think this particular one is definitely a good pair just from how they feel in the hand and how they, you know, um, the size and everything. So um, as far as from the site, I mentioned that they do have two options, the 8x25 option, which is this one, and then the 10x25. And what they're saying is the um, the 8 the eight times uh, option is good for tracking motion. So if things are moving around, that's gonna be your best option versus the 10 option is better for stationary items if you wanna get some detail. So it says the eight time option, you get a wider, a wider field of view. Um, it's also more stable uh, as you're holding it in your hand and you get a brighter image. So again, because it's used for tracking that motion, you wanna make sure that uh, you get all those different features with the eight time uh, option versus the 10 time is more of a narrow field of view because obviously you're you know focusing in further into the subject. Um, you do get a larger magnification, um, but the image is gonna be less stable if you're moving around um, uh, and it's gonna be slightly less bright because you obviously you're focusing in closer into the item. So if you um, if you wanna, if it's gonna be a stationary item that you're focusing in, then you're gonna want the 10 time option. But either one, you're still gonna get a great option as far as the binoculars go. And again, with this one being the standard issue waterproof binocular. So, you know, the, the lenses will be water and fog proof, which is great. Uh, you do have a uh, they, what they call a no matter what lifetime warranty. So lifetime warranty on them, and that's great because again, if it's something that you're not going to be using quite often, um, you don't want that warranty to uh, lapse. If it's been a year or two or five that you haven't used it, then you pull it out to use it and something happens and they're not working correctly. So um, they are designed for maximum grip and protection, and I could definitely feel that. You know, the grip on here is really, really nice. And I like the fact that it's all the way around the binoculars themselves. It's not just like on the sides or on the top or, or on the bottom. You have it all around so as I'm gripping these I can definitely feel that they're not going to go anywhere and then as I mentioned um, waterproof and fog proof is a big thing because you never know when you're going to be using your binoculars maybe you're out on a boat or something like that and um, you want to make sure that you know if water gets on them or something like that it's not going to get inside and jeopardize your binoculars so that was a quick unboxing and first impressions on the um, Knox Provision Standard Issue Waterproof Binoculars, this one being in the 8x25 option in the cobalt blue color. Uh, as I mentioned, I'll leave a link below in case you guys want to check these or any other other binoculars out. Let me know if you guys have any questions. Thanks.